Welcome to Let's Talk About That, the show about the show. I'm Stevie, and I'm feeling it now, Mr. Krabs. This week's guests both need TP for their bungholes, but have never reached great cornholio status. Please welcome Rhett and Link. Oh, and Barbara and Jade. I think Barbara and Jade have reached great cornholio status. Hello, Jade. You're gonna do so good. Yeah, you're gonna do you're so good. A good girl. You're the star. Yeah, you're, you're the my real star. You're, my you're gonna do child. it. I love you. I like you more than my boys. That's good. That's good. You wanna get comfy? You wanna get a back rub? Huh? You wanna get a belly rub? You want a Zerbert? You wanna get a Zerbert? <laughs> you wanna lick me in the mouth? That's fine. Hey guys. Oh hey. <laughs> This hey. is totally what goes on hey, Stevie. when you're is, not on camera. Hey. Look at that pink belly. Uh, Barbara, that's so indecent. No, let me hold it together. What I mean Barbara, is... Barbara, that's so indecent. This is the internet. It's fine. We're going to get demonetized, Barbara. Guys, there's a lot to do this week, and I'm distracted by the cuteness of the dogs that are before me. How long can you Settle stay down, here? Yeah, I think Barbara's going to be soon. So. Settle down, dogs. Okay, bye. You know what? Let her wonder. It's fine. Uh, we have a lot to do today. We have a lot of things that really matter that we've got to do. Cool. That's right. Um, we had Ava Gatowski on the show earlier this week mm -hmm. to taste some store-bought salsas. What she did not do was taste the weird-ass salsas that we have just right under here. So that's going to be Snack it. our job. Make sure that Barbara doesn't get into the sauces. They are closed. Uh, also, did you guys hear about some kind of amazing book cover release that happened this what? week? What? Yeah. Who wrote a book and who has a book with a cover? Yeah. Wow. So we have that wow. cover. And not the book, but a book that it, the cover's around that's a placeholder book today. Yeah physically that we were going to talk about briefly excited about that um and also th there's a game that i wanted to play uh that, that you can play along with at home it involves listening to audio from recent episodes of gmm and then trying to guess what episodes that audio is from Ooh. i'm calling it listen up i'm only going to play this once so we'll play that okay um but before all of that um, I am really hot. Are you guys hot? <laughs> oh, I just like, I what can't. What is that? Like, oh, I just need some air. What like the jacket's doing? just like. I can't see oof. it over your laptop. It's a picture. Well, you know what? It is a rendering of not my actual body. <laughs> hey, yeah, there I it is. I did not. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, no. <laughs> Oh my I never gosh. thought I'd see the day, Rhett. Oh, I'm not going to finish that sentence because I, I, I couldn't. <laughs> I thought that was part of the design until no. you pulled the, the patch off. Uh, did you have one of those just made? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just, I did. just for you? I, uh, yeah, Mike I'm, and Lucas made this for me because I thought it Stevie. was really cool, but I'm also flattered. like it has an, another really cool part to it. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> It's got a David on the back yeah. of it. Can you guys see that? Crop just so it? that his nipples are still in. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was important. Yeah, you know? you know what? You could probably sell that what at a is? boutique. That part didn't come with gaff tape because I can't like reach. I guess I can. What am I touching now? You're almost touching his hand. Keep going further. No, other, other way. way. Other, other way. way. Other way. Now you you're go. touching his hand. Uh -huh. You're holding hands with the naked David on the back of your shirt. He's oh, wow. just shirtless. I don't know that he's naked. Oh, yeah. He's wearing oh. bottoms. Incidentally, the poster um, is in Stevie's office. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Anyway, so if you guys want one of these, just, like, DM me. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's see how many requests you get. <laughs> um, okay, what I usually say is, but first, we're going to eat or drink. And and so I what do we're all my to... life, but first. Um, <laughs> yeah, just back in slowly. Oh, yeah. Not in this case. Um, we are going to try Scandinavian cheese coffee. Of course which, we are. Um, on Two Foods and a Lie, which is a game that pl we played this week, there were a bunch of really weird real foods and you guys didn't get to eat any of them. So I thought like, let's just try one. Um, now I think that Jen and John had cheese tea, which is another yep. thing, uh -huh. um, but they haven't had cheese coffee. So David, would you mind bringing out the cheese coffee? So yeah, cheese tea, coffee. they serve it somewhere in LA, but. I've yet to have it, so might as well start with cheese coffee. So I, I have some information about this cheese coffee. 
The water of northern Sweden you, is pure and free from many trace minerals. Oh gosh, Thank there's you. huge chunks And of when consumed in, in large quantities by voracious coffee drinkers, it is rumored to cause sodium deficiencies. I don't understand the logic in that, but okay. It is believed that enjoying some, and this is the type of cheese that's in it, Kaffeeost. Kaffeeost. Oh yeah, Kaffeeost. Kaffeeost. Uh, helps solve this problem. Uh, and Kaffeeost translates to coffee cheese. <laughs> coffee cheese. In America, it's known as Finnish squeaky cheese. Oh, squeaky cheese. Now, the one thing I will say is that it seems a little bit weird to have cheese in your coffee, but you put milk in your coffee. True. Dairy product. Right. If it's a mild cheese, so we'll I just, probably, I feel like that's dangerous. Pro oh, we're probably doing it. have the, the, the dink before Distant the cheese. Dink. Okay. Okay. What you think, Jay? What? That is delicious. How much sugar did you put in here? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it is just. Is it? Just is there sugar like in it? Sugar. Yeah, it tastes like a very sweet, creamy coffee. Like, I would be surprised if you were to give me a spoon and I were to hoist out a piece of cheese and be like, "Oh." Oh my God, this is delicious. Sugar is great. I know. Let's just eat a piece did, of cheese. D yeah. Did you eat the cheese? Because it looks like custard. This is what happens when you don't allow yourself sugar in coffee, and then you have sugar in coffee, and then oh you're like, "Oh my gosh." Ugh. Oh my gosh. Is the cheese, does the cheese Whoa. taste the like cheese sugar? The cheese is incredible. Mm, like a smell. I'm moving. This is some freaking good cheese. To Hold what on. kind is it again? It's very tangy. Wow. And it, I mean, when you... I guess oost is cheese in, in that language. Wow. <laughs> Whatever that language is. What? Where's it from? Finnish squeaky cheese is mm. what Americans call it. Good God. What? Stupid this is Americans. so good. You know what I feel like would pair really well with this? Weird salsas. Yeah. yeah, that's what I was thinking. Um, I'm very pleased. Okay, so I narrowed. I love what it does to the. It's the, really the, good. It doesn't make the cheese melt. It just makes it warm. Is Jade? Okay. <laughs> I just now noticed where she was and she, what she was doing. She's here. Um, come here. Okay, let's move on to salsas. Uh, I, I've narrowed it down. We're gonna start with the least weird. Well, I mean, I don't know. I Maybe can't stop it's looking at your weird. shirt. <laughs> yes. You know, I like to. Aren't I, you getting cold? I would like Aren't to. Aren't you getting so cold? I would like to pose for a, a redo of the shirt. Not. I would like to pose. I would like to. Weird. Well, you did pose. I want to offer my body to science. I mean, art. You already did. That was the result. Blackberry salsa. Your Medium. wiener is the size of an infant's nose. <laughs> <laughs> According to my specifications. Yeah, I don't. I don't. I just don't remember posing for. Do so we have? We have to. Yeah, yeah. Come on out. Come on out, David. Don't be. Don't be. Don't wait for me. <laughs> Thank you. Is that an infant's nose? <laughs> and then do we have? Yes. Thank you. I think I'm gonna dip out of here. I'm sorry. I didn't hear wow. anything you guys were talking about. We're talking about. Thank you. An infant's nose. That looks like a. It looks like a mole situation. That's for you. Oh, you get your own. Yeah, I'm just gonna use this jar. That definitely looks like a mole. I don't get my own. I get 30% less. Okay, um, so this okay. is this is supposed to be bad? No, no, it's supposed to be weird. Yeah, this is not supposed to be bad. Is it hot, though? It's room temp. It's good. It's hmm. very sweet. Yeah. Not um, as sweet I don't as mind cheese a, I don't mind a sweet salsa. I'm a savory man. Oh, you know what? Maybe I was going to make you guess. What, what's your guess that this is? Blueberry? <laughs> Close. Blackberry. Yeah, you got it. Yeah. Oh. Were you being serious? Because I told you what it was. You were talking about your 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 penis drawing. So oh. you weren't listening. Right. Neither okay? one of us were listening to anyone else. It works out sometimes. It's, it's not, not always frustrating. Again, I call that a date. It's not my penis drawing. <laughs> oh, my God. It's a rendering some someone's idea of my penis. <laughs> it's not my penis drawing. It's my penis drawing. <laughs> Um, okay, this was good. I give it a good. Yeah, I give it a good, not a great. I mean, it, if I want blackberry jam, I'm gonna get that. If I want salsa, I'm gonna get salsa. But if you want both, you get I, this. I never need right both here. together. Now, we are moving on to something I'm not gonna tell you what it is. Okay. And then you're gonna guess what it is. So we can bring that out and I'll show Morgan. Hold on. I oh, just, I'm so sorry. I what I like meant that. was, don't look at me. I'm about to do okay, this right I now. I couldn't read don't. it. Don't. I couldn't read it. I only thing I saw was garlic. Don't look at me. Ugh. I'm not looking at you. I'm looking at me. Link. I'm looking at you on my shirt. Me on my shirt. Me on your shirt. Me too? Yeah. 
<laughs> Can you bring the salsa over? Can, let, yes. Right, get the salsa. Oh man. I, I was looking over there because I was I thought the salsa was coming. I want to taste it. That's the point of this thing. I don't think we're gonna like this based on the smell. I would go easy. This is like not what makeup people do <laughs> to put things in focus. Just go to the side. Mm. I'm afraid. Is this kimchi? Is it? Yeah. This is kimchi. It's kimchi salsa. salsa. Yeah. It's not bad. Once you know, kimchi. once you know that it's kimchi. It's O food, kimchi, salsa, tomato, and garlic. I like kimchi. I don't um, love kimchi, man. I see kimchi has that kind of pungency that like the that we always talk about where it's like I hate myself and I'm eating this and I love it. You know, like I hate this. Yeah, it's called Yeah, what is the word? Um it's called, Link, what is the word, Link? Uh it's called benign masochism. Benign masochism. Mm -hmm. uh, and I need some more cheese coffee. It's one of the most healthy things that you can consume. Mm -hmm. Not the cheese coffee. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's not good for <laughs> The no. kimchi. It's like you do this all the time, your bio. What is it called? <laughs> Why am I asking you about words? <laughs> biome. <laughs> He's got two in a row. Wow. Your gut biome. Well, thank biome. you. Every time you have that. I'm gonna have to go um, back to the blackberry because I didn't like the kimchi. Okay. We'll say. Well, but I say this is good. We got I give more. it a good. We have one more. I give this a good and a good. And our last one. Don't look. Don't look at me. Oh, we yeah. The come in, come in, David. I'm sorry. I know I sound scary. <laughs> Thanks. Don't. My neighbor back in North Carolina would make some homemade salsa and that's bring it a, over. That's got a funny smell. And it looked just like that. And then a year later when it was still in my pantry, it looked just like that. Oh. I just forgot it was in there. Uh -huh. This is not- Oh! I don't like this <laughs> Why does it taste like that? That doesn't even make any sense. It's tapenade. It, that, that's what it tastes like? Which would be great if that's uh, what it was. Olive. It has a lot of olives in it. Oh, damn. It is. You have not guessed what it is. It is a vegetable, though. Eggplant. Asparagus. Asparagus. Yeah, yeah, you taste the asparagus? Yeah. It says asparagus? the um. it has its own tagline. <laughs> Which is? Taste the fruit, but it's also a skew. No, it's not a skew. It's is just Is asparagus a fruit? I don't think so. I kind of like it. No, asparagus yeah. is certainly not a fruit. But Once it is you know it's asparagus? Free. No, I give this a not. A nil. A not. Okay, we've done it. Link gives it a nil. <laughs> um, okay, I have yet another thing to take and put on the desk, and it's not the shirt. So let me clear these things before I do this thing. So um, I'm sure you've seen on our social medias, if you follow us on social medias. I, I do. I, I don't generally. I do. I no, do. Okay. Um, and it was also on Entertainment Weekly this past week, but the cover of uh, The Lost Causes of Bleak Creek is officially out. announced and out there in the world. And I have this little physical, I mean, it's not little. Look at that. It's book size, physical. It, it uh, really feels real when you book. can see it wrapped around a book that's not actually it. That's a book, that's not our book, but that mm -hmm. is a book with a cover on it that is our cover. Do you want this? Do you want to hold this? I do. Now, as you can see, we're doing something really retro for this book. Nothing on the back. <laughs> That's the new thing, the old thing. No, actually, we haven't designed that part yet, or this part. We've only designed this part. So but that's we all we're going to show you. Read a little, read a little excerpt. Yeah, read a little excerpt. First of all, they put it on this book upside down. <laughs> and. Anatoly Petrovich arrived in Yalta to try to bed my grandmother a fortnight into our trip. What? Stop. <laughs> so this is not our book. <laughs> that is the first thing that I read. This is some book that we had in the office. Have you been reading again? <laughs> uh, well, when um, I heard about grandma, I had to start reading again. <laughs> So anyway, <laughs> as, a few things about this. I mean, first of all, as, hold it while you talk yeah, about it. You can see that it's aged, and that was our way of saying that, like, hey, the events inside of this book take place in the past. In fact, in the year 1992. But also, I have like the entire collection of Goosebumps and the entire collection of Animorphs 
and the entire collection of Erie, Indiana. And they all like, yeah, they, they, that's exactly what they look like at this point. It's They've just aged like, from that era. Yeah. You read them so many times and then they're just beautiful. Uh, there's some clues um, in, as to what happens within the book on the outside of the book that we don't have to go into. Um, <laughs> some clues. They're really selling it. Yeah. We wrote it. That's a hint. <laughs> Do you want to talk about like the Jason Moore who designed the book? Yes. So, uh, shout out to Jason Moore who did this design for us. Thank you, Jason. Excellent yeah. work. So basically, all that we said was, "Hey, bro," as we call him, bro. Mm -hmm. Like, "Hey, bro, we want a hand in some water. We want it bubbling and glowing. Here's the title. We we're the authors. <laughs> we previously <laughs> wrote a number one." <laughs> New York Times bestselling. Maybe put that put on there. Put that on there. And uh, boom. It was, this is what he did. I mean, he did a great job, but it wasn't that easy. I mean, he also read the entire book. He did. Yeah. He actually, and, so yeah, he read the book and came back with a bunch of different ideas. To some of them get were really vibe. creepy, which actually made me feel good. It's like the thing that resonated with him from a, you know, from a visual artist standpoint were these like, creepy gripping scenes that made me feel good that what we had tried to do worked you know that he was like oh i i visualized this and i thought it would be cool what if that was on the cover and there were like there were more than a handful of um candidates for that which you know when you when you work so hard to write a book every person you entrust to read it whatever the first thing they say they come back with means a lot. If you ever read somebody's book, be careful what you say the next time you see them because you're basically hanging on every word. And that applied to everybody, including uh, him. And so I, I thought all of his ideas were cool. There's gonna be 25 different versions of the cover. Yeah, you have to I'm buy saying. all 25. <laughs> yeah. uh, the one thing I'll say is that, you know, as this continues to become more and more of a real thing, like this is like the next really significant step in it becoming a real tangible thing that you can have in your hands this fall, October 29th, to be exact, um, I just get more and more excited, you know, because it is, I mean, and it's also made for dogs, mm -hmm. as you can see. But, you know, I, people I'm like just, to look at the dogs. So I'm, I'm just, I, I'm super excited about this, about the story, and we've talked a little bit about the story, but see that? And actually, one in 25 books comes with a, a long haired Dotson. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. We're doing anything we can't. No. I, said, I told you not to say that. Um, but That's as it becomes, as we get closer and closer to that day, I just get excited about people having this story, interacting with this story, and us talking about this story as a community because I am as excited about this as I've ever been about anything we've created. Yeah, yeah, we've like, gotten a lot I'm of so like excited. amazing, amazing. I can't, I can't calm down breathe, from the man, people breathe. who have, have gotten awesome. to read the book. We've gotten a bunch of amazing emails, and uh, we're very excited for you guys to be able to to read it. And if you want to be one of the first people to get your copy, go to bleakcreek.com where you can pre-order the book. Um, it'll have this artwork on that page now. Yes. It's amazing because it exists. If you want to have that book <laughs> in your page. hand on October 29th, go ahead and pre-order. Um, okay. So now it is time to play the uh, the soundbite game that I titled at the top that I can't remember what I titled it. Um, you only get one chance to hear this. Thank you. Something like that. Yeah, it was something like that. Um, so I feel like, I mean, I don't know. I think that you're going to be pretty good at this, actually. I think the mythical beasts are going to be really good at it. Okay. Uh, so They'll the be way you play is, is very easy. I'm going to play a clip, and then you're going to have to guess what episode of GMM or maybe GMR okay. uh, the clip is from. And then there will be a, a, a video to tell you if you're right or wrong. Are is it the first person to guess it? Ready. Is that how you do it? No, I would appreciate it if you let the clip play out first okay. and then guess it. Are we playing together? Yeah, you okay. can play together. Okay, ready? Ready. Three, two, one. Okay, look at that. Grab yours. Well, the color is unexpected, but I think that I'm going dry. You should go dry first. I'm gonna go dry. First. You know? Oh, oh, <laughs> it's hard. I always say nothing livens up a party like a pair of chaps. Well, it's white and it, it makes children. It's, it's gone. It's gone. I'm out. I'm out. I'm flat out of sperm. What? Oh. 
So this was uh, all from seems, one episode? That seemed like yeah. a montage of our entire GMM career. <laughs> Not just one video, I hope. That was one episode. Oh, gosh. That, that was, was one episode. That has to be sperm. That was Willa Dumpling. The only time we we ate sperm was Willa Dumpling. That, that was real at dumpling. Yeah, right. It's that was be. really good. Still trap, y'all. I sperm. think that I'm going dry. You should go dry first. I'm gonna go dry. First. You know. Oh, oh, <laughs> it's hard. It's gone. It's gone. I'm out. I'm out. I'm flat out of sperm. <laughs> flat out, flat of, sperm. out of sperm. I always um, get distracted by how dark my hair is in all those old clips. Would you say unnaturally dark? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna I didn't go. die. I didn't die every square inch of my head. I only dyed the, um, the gray parts. Are you kidding? Really? Yeah, I brushed it in. So it was like, I mean, the part that's gray. But then I think when Why? I washed it out, Why? it would start to bleed. And then there were t sometimes more than others, like his whole ha his whole hair looks dyed. But I didn't intend for that to happen. <laughs> <laughs> Um, okay, Zach, we're gonna go directly to the second clip. I, they did get the first one. I thought this one was gonna be easier, but I, I just wanna hear it anyway, so let's go to the second clip. Let's blow on each other. Ooh, ooh, I got deep on that one. She can put it in any hole. <laughs> Congratulations, rich daughters everywhere. <laughs> that was mouthwash ranking. <clears throat> yeah, I thought that one was gonna be easy. Blow, yeah, because we were blowing in each other's face. Hey, oh yeah, the rich daughters. Let me, rich daughters. let me say, shout out to the creator this is what he wanted when he sent us more stuff, and I'm gonna give it to him. Okay. Shout out to the man who started TheraBreath. He sent us a, a bunch of other flavors of TheraBreath. I don't he, think he personally did. Oh, no, no, he, he did. It was, either him, it was either him or his daughter. <laughs> There's only two people that work at the company. You smell, you smell something? Yeah. So they, shout out to him. They sent us more stuff because they said, we want you guys to taste some other flavors. And I gotta say, hmm? just earlier today, hmm. I had one of the one of them. It was so memorable, I can't remember the name of the yeah, flavor. Yeah, it's good. But I thought it was very refreshing. And this Sparkle is when we throw up the, the lower third. It goes directly to their website. Um, you guys are really, really good at this. I wonder if the Mythical Beasts at Home are, are uh, winning by guessing before you do, but let's just play another one. There we go. That's how I take my underwear off. I think I could do that hands-free at certain points. Oh, really? Yeah, Are man. You been doing your squats? Yes. <laughs> well, I was thinking you would bite it, uh, but you sucked it. So I have insertion. Okay. Um, it seems like there's there's a, there's a theme to these audio clips you chose. So, I don't know what you mean. Yeah, they're GMM episodes. <clears throat> this is. What was that? That was when I you were shaving I, no. a turkey. It's when I stuck my electric knife. Let's put a mid roll in. <laughs> <laughs> that was why I did that. Into the football. <clears throat> the so, football? Oh yeah, when we when we. Uh, so that was skip. satisfying videos. Satisfying mm, things. You are right about the 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 thing the the what you were doing, but it wasn't satisfying it was, videos. It was like a specific theme of that episode. Yeah, it was fruit peeling. Yeah, that's the same. But, but but still, you were really good. Okay. Let's see it. There we go. That's how I take my underwear off. <laughs> 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 well, I was thinking you would bite it, uh, but you sucked it. <laughs> Man, it's all unintentional, by the you way. You sucked it. Um, okay, here's the final clip. I'm gonna shake this. We're gonna deposit it into our mouth holes. Just like, let it have it. Just go all the way down. Go all the way down. Go all the way down. Go. <laughs> Be so gentle. Weird, Be gentle. We're gonna do the old squeeze and pull. <laughs> oh, squeeze it real good. Squeeze it all the way down. Just put it in your mouth and hold it, okay? <laughs> Don't bite down. <laughs> it's like snot coming out of my nose. I think yeah. I need to hear that one again. Let's <laughs> play it again. No, you know, you this. said, you said that the whole game hole. was you weren't gonna play Just it again. Let it happen. Oh, go all the way down. Go all the way down. Go all the way down. Go. Be so gentle, weird. be gentle. <laughs> We're gonna do the old squeeze and pull. <laughs> I don't so like that cough. Yeah. Stop it. <laughs> Stop it, don't look at me. Stop looking at me. Oh. Go all the way down. So what were you squeezing and pulling? Go I don't remember. 
It wasn't that long ago. I honestly do not remember this one. I remember it, but I don't know. I can't place it. No, all the way down. Squeeze him. Hold on. It was when something... Go all the way down. I was squeezing something and you were pulling it. Mm-hmm. It was a it was a teamwork thing. What did we need to squeeze and pull? You're you're on the right track. You're there. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry I looked at you like that. <laughs> you're so close to the answer. I was, just go I was all just, the way down. I was just thinking really hard. <laughs> what are y'all laughing at? Oh. What happened? Yeah. <laughs> he just looked at me like. I don't know, like I was being a really good coach and he was like really trying hard for the answer. Uh, like it was like very intense. Yeah, it was. It was intense. <laughs> and in the context, it was just... Uh, <laughs> what was it? I don't know. No, okay. Oh you were teaming up on something because you didn't have something else that you needed in order to accomplish it. So one of you had to hold a thing and the other oh. one of you... It was when we... We're doing like the two arm challenge thing. <laughs> kind no. of. Let's let's see it. Just like let it have it. Just. We're gonna do the old squeeze and pull. <laughs> we were holding hands and more. Yes. Oh. Just put oh, it in yeah. your mouth and hold it. Okay. That wasn't long ago. I knew it was recent. Don't bite down. Yeah. I knew it was recent. Yeah. But it's a fine. It's a fine. <laughs> it's a fine. Uh, <laughs> we live a cover. <laughs> all right. So that's that's all I have. That's I'm all very you, pleased, that's all I'm very pleased with mean. myself that's today. All you need. Yeah, right. That's all you need. Okay, are you ready for our final line? Yes. Until next. Next L T A T. Keep on, on B Y M B. Oh, See if I can find something else in this book. <laughs> Man, boys like this make me relieve my barely teenage brother is gay. What? 